Hello and welcome viewers, you're watching In-Depth with your host Ruti Mishra, a platform where we break the most complex issues of the world and our country in just five simple questions and their five simple answers and help you understand how these issues matter to you. The Competition Commission of India has imposed a fine of around 1300 crore on tech giant Google for abusing its dominant position in multiple markets in the Android mobile device system. So what is Competition Commission of India? Well, the Competition Commission of India is a statutory body of the Government of India responsible for enforcing the Competition Act of 2002. The Monopolies and Restrictive Trade Practices Act of 1969 or the MRTP Act was repealed and replaced by the Competition Act of 2002 on the recommendations of the Raghavan Committee. Competition Commission of India aims to establish a robust competitive environment through proactive engagement with all stakeholders including consumers, industry, government and international jurisdictions. The Competition Commission consists of one chairperson and six members as per the Competition Act, who shall be appointed by the central government. The Commission is a quasi-judicial body which gives opinions to statutory authorities and also deals with other cases. The chairperson and other members are whole-time members. So what is the Competition Act of 2002? Well, this Act was passed in 2002 and has been amended by the Competition Amendment Act of 2007. The Act prohibits anti-competitive agreements, abuse of dominant position by enterprises and regulates acquisition, acquiring of control which causes or likely to cause an adverse effect on competition within India. In accordance with the provisions of the Amendment Act, the Competition Commission of India and the Competition Appellate Tribunal were established. Government replaced the Competition Appellate Tribunal with the National Company Law Appellate Tribunal in 2017. So what are the functions and the role of CCI? Well, it eliminates practices having adverse effects on competition. It promotes and sustains competition in markets, protects the interests of consumers, ensures freedom of trade in the markets of India, establishes a robust competitive environment. The Competition Commission is India's competition regulator and an antitrust watchdog for smaller organizations that are unable to defend themselves against large corporations. CCI has the authority to notify organizations that sell to India if it feels they may be negatively influencing competition in India's domestic market. A foreign company seeking entry into India through an acquisition or merger will have to abide by the country's competition laws. Assets and turnover above a certain monetary value will bring the group under the purview of the Competition Commission of India. And what are the achievements of the CCI till now? Well, the Commission has adjudicated more than 1,000 antitrust cases, that is, case disposal rate of 89% in antitrust cases. It has also reviewed more than 900 mergers and acquisitions till date, heard most of them within a record average time of 30 days. The Commission has also come up with several innovations, like the Green Channel provision for automated approval on combinations, transactions and cleared several such transactions. What is the origin of competition laws? Well, competition laws have a long history. It is believed that the laws against anti-competitive practices date as far as the Middle Ages when cartels, the so-called guilds, were formed in most European cities. A cartel is defined by an association of producers, sellers, distributors, traders or service providers who, by an agreement among themselves, limit, control or attempt to control the production, distribution, sale or price or trade in goods or provision of services. The English common law of the early 15th century prohibited contracts that restricted trade. The United States passed the Sherman Act in 1890. Today, nearly 140 jurisdictions across the world have some form of the legislation dealing in the subject matter of competition. India adopted its first competition law way back in 1969 in the form of Monopolies and Restrictive Trade Practices Act. However, as the times changed, the need was felt for a new competition law with a new stance. With the introduction of new economic policy and opening up of the Indian market to the world, the focus shifted from curbing monopolies to promoting overall competition in the Indian market. This led to the passage of the Competition Act of 2002. Well, viewers, that's all I could pack for you in this edition. Thanks for watching and stay tuned to Sunset TV. Namaskar.